Prince Louis, four, was joined by his two siblings as the royals watched the Platinum Jubilee pageant in front of Buckingham Palace. Prince George and Princess Charlotte attended the procession with the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and Prince Charles, with the Duchess of Cornwall. But as the senior royals enjoyed the sights of the pageant, Prince Louis was caught making mischief during the afternoon's event. One Twitter user, at Ruth underscore Clark, called Prince Louis's antics over the weekend hilarious, while at Dane Hall 798 posted, I was wondering if hashtag Prince Louis would top his balcony moves. Yeah. He did that. Twitter user at Cheesedoff3 then chimed in that Prince Louis was a legend in a four-year-old body. At Telechat underscore added, Prince Louis is absolutely adorable he's such a character. The prince could be seen putting his hand over the Duchess of Cambridge's mouth and upturning his own nose with his thumb at points in the parade. He placed his hands over his eyes, seemingly fed up with the length of the three-kilometer-long parade. He was caught yawning and then made his way over to Prince William, perching on the Duke's lap as the final event of the Jubilee weekend got underway. He stood up in his seat during the spectacle after appearing to gesture to Prime Minister Boris Johnson, who was sitting behind the young prince, with a confused expression. Zara Tyndall's husband, Mike, at one point gestures to the youngest Cambridge prince, to let him know he is being playfully warned. Prince Louis's facial expressions took center stage on Thursday, as the royals stepped out for the very first of the weekend's jubilee events. The young royal accompanied his siblings and parents on the Buckingham Palace balcony for the historic RAF flypast. The Red Arrow's spectacular show closed the Trooping the Color Parade, observing the Queen's official birthday. Louis gestured towards the plane soaring overhead and clapped his hands over his ears, appearing to shout as the aircraft shot across central London. He again pulled exaggerated funny faces, putting his fingers in his mouth and waving at pilots. But the youngest child of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge did not make the trip to Wales on Saturday along with the rest of his family. Kate, William, George and Charlotte stopped off in Cardiff to see the final preparations for the Jubilee concert staged on Saturday afternoon, ahead of the party at the Palace in London later that evening. Anna Jones, 53, who had been in town to pick up her wedding dress, and new friend Sandra Harris, 74, engaged the children in a lively conversation about the Jubilee. Where's your brother? They wondered. We were wondering where he was. Prince William told them the trip would have been a bit much for the four-year-old, gesturing to the floor where he jokingly predicted Louis might have laid down. The ladies asked the children how their first trooping carriage ride had been, telling Princess Charlotte they had seen how she stopped Louis waving nearly too much in top big sister fashion. Is she bossy, George, they joked, to laughter. At least you didn't say it was mummy who was bossy, Kate told him. The Cambridge clan then made their exit out of the castle gates, in front of a crowd of members of the public and photographers. Charlotte appeared absorbed in admiring a bunch of tulips she had been given, tied with a ribbon. Thank you very much, the Duke said as they were leaving. Good luck tonight. It is the first time the two children have made an official visit to Wales. Prince George, 8, will one day buy Prince of Wales, and, as the Duchess told one concert organizer, lived there in Anglesey when he was a small baby. Celebrating Wales, the Duchess wore a vivid red dress from Eponine and earrings from local brand Spells of Love. Prince Louis did not join the family for the 90-minute-long event, considered too young after his star turn at Trooping the Color this week. As Prince William joked to one member of the public during a walking, he could have done anything in the excitement, including lying down on the floor for fun. Prince George and Princess Charlotte, 7, at times appeared shy during the event one of very few official engagements they have done in their short royal lives. Both politely shook hands with dignitaries and countless members of the public, introduced over and over by their parents as this is George, and this is Charlotte. Sticking close to their parents and often holding hands with either Duke or Duchess, the children were dressed smartly, George as a mini-me of his father in a smart suit and brown suede shoes with no tie, and Charlotte with her neat plates and white ankle socks. Thank you.